Public defenders say there is a delay in justice for the hundreds of people arrested during the Houston protest. Channel 2 Sion Rhodes is live downtown now with that story. Sion. And they're worried that these protesters who've been arrested could be having their civil rights violated. U of H student Rafael Acosta says he was one of hundreds arrested over the weekend during protests seeking justice for George Floyd. Why are we being held and detained here for peacefully protesting? He was charged with obstructing a roadway. We moved to a sidewalk. After you tell us to move to the sidewalk, you entrap us and then arrest us for obstruct. It, it seems insanely absurd. He was taken to HPD to a facility on Reasoner Street. They put us in like... I swear, it looks like a playpen for animals. At least 30 to 40 people. I can't put my hands out without touching people. In all, he says he was held for 36 hours. We're especially worried about uh, people being detained beyond what's legally required. The Harris County Public Defender's Office says the mass arrests are leading to a delay in justice. What well, delayed that was the uh, Houston Police Department was not bringing them directly to the sheriff. Uh, they were actually being held... Uh, at, uh, at Reasoner Street, the old Houston jail, and uh, for a very long time. In a statement, HPD said the hold at Reasoner was necessary because of the large amount of people arrested and that the detainees are being treated humanely. This is just gross negligence. HPD also says they are cons constantly updating this and reviewing ways to make this system of mass arrest more efficient. Reporting live downtown, Sion Rhodes, KPRC, Channel 2 News.